Combine the methane, sulfur, and charcoal in proportion and get a black powder, which is the gunpowder. In order to release this powerful force, you put the gunpowder into the main barrel and ignite it. But the main barrel can't stand the pressure and often explodes. So you replace the main barrel with the barrel and put the gunpowder into the gunpowder. Then the gunpowder shoots out like an arrow. In order to improve the flight trajectory of the gunpowder, you change to a round egg and carve a smooth channel in the barrel. The bullet head and penetration are significantly improved. However, after firing, the barrel is too hot to hold. Every time you load the gunpowder, you need to cool it down slowly. In order to shoot continuously, you increase the length of the barrel, add a key, and drill a small hole on the side to insert the thread. After the key is inserted, it is extended to increase the temperature. The front barrel is kept thin to improve the accuracy, but the gunpowder residue quickly clogs the tube, so it is difficult to load the gunpowder in the third shot. Cleverly, you reduce the proportion of sulfur, add carbonized charcoal to burn cleaner, and slightly reduce the amount of smoke. When a new mixture is pushed into the gunpowder, the barrel is no longer hot, and the loading speed is doubled. In order to shoot better, you install a curved metal arm on the outside of the key and attach a soft fire rope at the end to buckle the mechanism to shoot. This design allows aiming and shooting to be synchronized. The gunpowder's landing point is finally controllable. Congratulations, you invented the gunpowder.